Welcome to TechEasy. Good morning to everyone. Today in this video, we'll see how you can download and install Zotero software on your laptop or the computer. You can use this Zotero software for the academic purpose or the research purpose where you can store as a centralized library for the your documentation papers, research papers or for citations and references. This is the best available software and which is for free. So on Google, you can search as Zotero download and this website, you'll see zotero.org slash download. Anyway, I'll drop link in the description. You can see I'm just downloading 64 bit software, which my laptop is 64 on my download folder. If I just click on double click, the installation process is started. Once this installation is completed, I'll install that Chrome extension also because I'm going to use that Chrome extension for Zotero also. I'll just click on next, next, next until it gets finished so it has finished now i'll go to the same website so this is on the desktop shortcut it has created if you double cl click on this this centralized library to save all your uh, references citations and everything gets opened and see here on this you can click on chrome installer and add to the chrome and the extension gets installed you can pin it here so that you'll see this particular chrome extension for zotero here and this is the zotero software what it you'll see Click on the My Library and there is a magic tool see here. For example, if there is a general uh, available on the web with PMID, click on this magic tool and paste it here. Click on the Enter. This Zotero software will automatically fetch all the details about this journal published. And when you double click on this, it will show you in the PDF format also. See here, this is the PDF format. G this is just with the PMID. Okay. And another way also you can get the citations or references to the Zotero which is through Chrome extension. Open any page on the Chrome browser which may be a Wikipedia page or any journal. For example, say this Wikipedia page. Click on the extension and you will find save to the Zotero or right click you will find this option. I am just clicking on save to Zotero with Snapchat. See here, uh, just within a while this appears here. Just with one click of extension, likewise you can open any web page and click on this uh, Zotero extension or right click and click on save to all these references or the citations or the publications will be available in your library of Zotero. Now we'll see how you can deal with duplicates on Zotero. For example, if you save the same web page or the same article more than once in Zotero, for example, in this tutorial, I'm just saving this particular web page twice. Okay. Uh, I'll just minimize this and on my Zotero, you'll find this duplicate item. See here, the same page two times. Click on the duplicate items and select them and click on merge two items. So this will be useful if you have duplicate generals with the same or the different versions. And uh, for example, go to my library. If you want to delete any particular reference on your uh, list of library, just select that and right click and click on move to trash. So this gets deleted and it will be available under the trash folder. And even if you want to delete from here, right click and clear or empty the trash. Now we'll see how you can organize all these citations and references with the folder structure. On the my library, just right click and click on add a new item. Just like the folder name, you can give the appropriate name. And how you can add the list of items here, just drag and drop drag and drop the reference which you want to a particular folder or the items collection likewise you can create n number of folders and just drag and drop all these items accordingly and i'll just minimize this and i'll open a word document and where i'm writing an uh, article on what is artificial intelligence and here i'll show you how i use zotero for the citations and the references purpose see here I didn't do anything but Zotero option is already included when I just installed Zotero on my software. I opened uh, Zotero and click on the add citations. Remember wherever the cursor is there, there this citation will appear. So I already clicked on the citation and it is loading up. See here Zotero. Which citation or the reference I need? I just searched as artificial and it has shown I clicked on this forward symbol, uh, forward symbol so that the citation gets added automatically from my Zotero. And when I click on add bibliography, 
the associated bibliography will automatically appears with this Zotero software. See here, the citation turns into bibliography and you can refresh or when you click on document preference, if you want a different style than APA, here you can choose. Not only here, on the Zotero also, when you click on Zotero, the software, uh, under edit, file and edit, under settings, under site, here the citation uh, styles will be available, more number of citations will be available. Choose one or if you have a downloaded version, you can get it from your computer also. In this way, you can make use of Zotero. If you do have any other questions, please do ask in the comments. And thanks for watching. Have a nice day.